more scripts. He it, it, he may have heard people on the inside go, "Oh, this guy's a has been," you know. Now he he he's turning out bullshit. He's making these goddamn look who's talking mm-hmm. fucking movies. He's doing a third one. <laughs> His career is over. He may it may have sunk into where he's just like, "Oh fuck, I'm that guy now." Well, fuck, and then he happens to look at a script. Somebody sends a script his way, and he's like, "Wow, somebody's sending this to me. This is delivered to yeah. the right place." Yeah. Fuck it, you know. Um, I want to show I can act again. You know, you you become humble once you realize that you're a fucking well, I, either yeah. you're you're a laughing stock, and you realize that nobody you're you're no longer relevant. Well, no, that I mean, Eddie Murphy is becoming that laughing stock. I mean, yeah. we see Eddie Murphy doing Eddie Murphy and everything. Yeah. Eddie Murphy, look, people. I'm not the kind of guy who wants to go out and talk shit about people and say, no, no, no. you know, that you, that, you it know, happens to everyone. You, yeah, it happens. Yeah. You know, you you hate somebody. Yeah, this, you know, look, yeah. I don't, I don't wish anything bad on anyone. I mean, yeah. it's like uh, hey, it, everyone you know. wants Eddie Murphy to fucking be great again, like oh, yeah. he was, like fucking the Beverly Hills Cop films. I mean, I still, I still look for that. You know, his golden, his golden years, fucking being a stand-up comedian. Where he, to me, I can still watch all those fucking old stand-up shows. You know, I have them on DVD. Where he's fucking, he's still brilliant. You know, he's still well, he's well, see, awesome. You know, I don't his even delivery. See, yeah, no, I don't want to see Eddie Murphy yeah. go back to being that kind of Eddie Murphy. I want to mm-hmm. see Eddie Murphy uh, advance. I want to see him progress. Yeah. I want to see him evolve. I want to mm-hmm. see Eddie Murphy. I want to see somebody take uh, a movie yeah. uh, where the director has it yeah. just is in control enough to say, yeah. "Listen, like, like, uh, what's his name did with." Uh, Oh, uh, what's his name in the wrestler? Uh, uh, oh, Mickey uh, Rourke. Mickey Rourke. He comes in and yeah. says, "You have to listen to what I tell you." And that's mm-hmm. somebody needs to come in with balls up to say, "Eddie, I don't care who you are. Yeah. I'm trying to help you, and I'm trying to help myself. Yeah. You have the potential to be yeah. great, mm-hmm. and we're going to do this. And I'm, you're going to take my direction, yeah. and this is going to be a more serious role mm-hmm. for you. Yeah. Maybe it's a side role. Yeah. Maybe you're the main Stranger character. Who needs to say, "Look." This movie isn't about me, and it's not fucking about you. Yeah, it's about a fucking great film that will be remembered forever. Yeah. And you can either be a part of this, or you or, or you're not. I'll find somebody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll find somebody else. And 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 you know, hopefully, if this if this works out the way I plan it, we'll always be remembered. Are you in or you out? Yeah, thank you. That's it. Get the fuck out. <laughs> write a script right now because apparently you can direct Eddie Murphy. But that's what you need. You need to tell her. Yeah, yeah. Beverly you know. Hills Cop Part Four. <laughs> See, we don't even need that. We need we need, we need something. Delirious. Where Eddie, we need, where Eddie Murphy is like like a recovering alcoholic no, or a drug something. addict or something like that. You know what I mean? Like, I still want to be funny though. I mean, he can be funny. Arthur some Part uh, Arthur Part Three. Uh, the, <laughs> the, the black the, the black Arthur the black generation. <laughs> the black generation. <laughs> Making up shit. Yeah. The black generation. <laughs> yeah. Man, I saw some shit. No. Though. Eddie Murphy. Look, people. I'm saying is Eddie Murphy is great, mm-hmm. and just because he makes these family films, don't undermine him. Yeah. Uh, just like, oh, that's what I was gonna say in, uh, about. We're going back to something I meant to leave. Uh, mm-hmm. I meant to like. I didn't mean to leave it off with this. Yeah. But uh, women who are aging in Hollywood, you know, what I think they need to do. Mm-hmm. I think they need to like kind of be prepared to work behind the camera too. Uh, yeah, we, yeah, a lot, a lot of a lot of girls are doing it. I mean, shit. you need when when a woman we reach isn't a Drew Barrymore. Age, Drew Barrymore yeah. was apparently she's producing, she's directing. I mean, I, the last rumor I heard was they were trying to get her to to direct uh, one of the Twilight films. So she ain't doing it though. Yeah. The guy who's yeah, directing yeah, yeah. the next one is uh, Chris White. Well, I think I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I know it wasn't. Well, I don't. Know. I don't know what. The, I just I read in a blurb. I think it was the third one they were considering her for. So. Oh, it could be. I mean, I like to see what she could do. I think. I mean, but yeah. you know, women need to be smarter. Like, I mean, now you don't have to be old or, right. or older. Just, just think about your career as mm-hmm. more than just. Well, that's when you think who, about what, what, just more, some, more than somebody who looks yeah. good in front of a camera. You think right. about what kind of career do I want to have that last? I mean, right. okay, I look good, but right. I want to show the real brains mm-hmm. is directing, producing, right. writing things. Or women can do that. Or just fucking do your job and fucking hone your craft as far as being an actress. And carry that through loud. different ages. Exactly. Yeah. Don't Learn, continue to try yeah. to be the young chick no, no, you're no, like, no. you know, don't 40 some years old. Don't look for those roles. I mean, I guess, okay, what was the fucking chick who was in those movies, all those romantic comedies? She, Which uh, one? She, 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 she always, she was she was in uh, You Got Mail. I, th- I knew you were going to name her. Yeah. Uh, What's her fucking name? Oh, wow. You know, when you put something on the spot, <laughs> it's like... <laughs> I, I only saw like two of her films, but like she was uh, she was the one that caused that she fight. Was be- she was the fucking stereotype, oh, fucking yeah. Uh, she caused that fight between uh, between uh, 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 oh, she, was his name? She, she used to be married to Dennis Quaid. She, she just started I mean, a fight between Dennis Quaid, yeah. and oh, what was his name? The Australian guy, uh, Russell Crowe. Oh, Russell Crowe. She started yeah. a fight between them. Uh, yeah. Like she was with she was with Randy Quaid, but she started yeah. like sleeping, up, sleeping around with Russell yeah. Crowe. Damn it! Um, God damn. Now I'm shocked. I, I haven't seen her in anything in a long time, but 
that was kind of the point. I think at some point she may have realized, you know what? I've done all I can with these movies, so and they've been all Meg Ryan. Meg Ryan. And I think there's there was some point where she was like, you know what? I've done all I can with these films. I'm at the age where I can't make these types of films anymore. So I'll exit. Even gracefully. though she did do finally a big nude scene when she was older oh, did in a she? movie in the cut. Okay, I have now, to watch a that. lot of people a lot of people <laughs> what? Them, in the butt in the what? butt no no <laughs> that's the one I want to do with her. Uh no uh she was uh I, she was uh, a lot of people yeah. make fun of her in that movie but she look she looked good. Yeah. I don't care what the movie was a piece of shit but she looked uh, good. Oh yeah. Well see that maybe was that the last film she did? I don't think so. Okay. But uh, I'm curious because I I remember like there's a string of those films where it might as well have been the same character. Um, but you never, I mean, after those films, you know, there's a point where I'm like, man, this, this chick is getting a little too old, a little too long in the tooth to be doing these types of films. And of course you never saw her again after that. So I hope she just, oh, that's right. She was in a movie in the land of women, uh, oh, okay. where she was, uh, she was having a thing with a younger guy. Uh, was in, that uh, sounds like an ensemble in, piece. It, that movie it? was not against, uh, it was not that good. She was in a, oh, she was in a, against the ropes with, uh, Omar Epps. Oh, that sounds perverted. But uh, <laughs> I wish it was. I, hey, everything she does, I wish it was perverted. Because I don't care what you say. Meg yeah. Ryan, I think she's a good-looking older woman. Yeah. But with a chick like that, I mean, I, 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 do, I would respect her if she just said, okay, you know, I can't really do these movies, so I'll, I'll just make a graceful exit, and that's it. Yeah. And maybe you come up. You well, come, she's still you, making stuff. You come up, is, she, is she still working? Yeah, I haven't heard from working. her in years. No, okay. she did The Women, and yeah. uh, I think she has a movie coming out later. Uh, yeah. Okay, let me look on IMDb. Yeah, Hold on. let's see what she's doing. Let, let, yeah. Let's let's uh, on, let me look and see. <laughs> see what she does. Let's see, let's <laughs> let's see what old, old let's Meg is up yeah, to. Let's see what old Meg is up to. Our, our old pal, old chum. All right, what are you doing, Meg? Yeah. Let's give her a call. <laughs> she's still hot, though. You know what? She's still I don't hot. Care what I mean, people hey. say she's still hot. No, no, she's. Oh, uh, she's hot, got a movie yeah. coming out. I'm looking on IMDb right now. Yeah. She's got a movie coming out called uh, Serious Moonlight. And you hope actors like is. her just don't settle for the same bullshit. I mean, you can only do that before, you know, for so many years until you just. Become you become like the Leslie Nielsen, of, you know, a parody. You might as well start doing parodies of those films. Even you know? though I'm looking at a picture right now, she is starting to look older. But uh, oh, she's, uh, hey, she's, that's life. That's life. But she's no, she's man, she's hot. I don't I'll still do it. Just just tell everybody I did it. I would. Yeah. Don't hey, don't hey, uh, come talk to me. Yeah. You know if you got a problem. Her and Melanie yeah. Griffith. Yeah. Both. Yeah, of. I fucked her. Yeah. Yeah, we hang out. It was a good time. Yeah. yeah. We drink shoot shit. I fucked, up, I fucked them together. Coffee talk. We made a Corey <laughs> sandwich. Uh, one slice of bread was Meg Ryan. The other yeah. slice was Melanie Griffith. Corey Hayden we tried, tried to hang out. We told him, get the fuck out of here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and, there, and, there, and there was uh, some lettuce made of Michelle Pfeiffer. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Michelle Pfeiffer? What happened to her? She's still hot. I mean, fuck. I don't know. She, she, I don't know, she, man. She needs, a, she needs to do something. I don't shit. know. I don't know. You know, all these yeah. women, I don't know. Once you're cat woman, you're, you're, you're always hot. It's like a fucking badge <laughs> of honor right there. If you're able to be fucking yeah, cat fucking, woman. That fucking latex suit Woo! will always do that shit to you. Yep. Uh, uh, but anyway, man. And so, yeah. uh, well, what was one more thing I want to talk about here? Uh, I can't remember. <laughs> oh, hey, did I tell you uh, I got to see... Uh, Mega Shark versus Giant squ- uh, Giant Octopus. Hyde told me about that. <laughs> Mega Shark versus Giant Octopus. That's a movie, people. Mega Shark yes. versus Giant Octopus. By those assholes, the the, the Transmorphers. asylum. Transmorphers. The asylum, yeah. They, Transformers. They, they, they do uh, snakes on a snakes on a train. Snakes on a train. <laughs> All that bullshit. Man, uh, I, Alien versus Hunter. <laughs> man, I was in a. I went to a convention uh-huh. in France where they had a, a booth. They yeah. had, and they were proud of that shit. Oh, at the yeah. time, yeah. that was the biggest achievement. Uh-huh. Snakes on a train. They had a poster <laughs> for that shit. And they were yeah. like, yes, this is our product here. Yeah. <laughs> Buy it, please. They had a what, movie, The Day the Earth Stood There. <laughs> Ridiculous, man. But, uh, oh, my God. I, I can't help like, That's good, man. It, it makes you, it makes you want it makes you want to fucking watch those films. You're like, oh my god, this is like this is like the poor man's version of a fucking blockbuster. Oh, they had and they I had, had one called I Am Omega. I Am Omega, yeah, with fucking uh, Mark DeCosco, yeah, fucking doing karate to goddamn zombies or whatever. <laughs> I was like, wow, this is shit. But the thing is, like, that company is attracting like fucking has been stars and well, it, it's, I mean, the, okay, uh, Mega Shark. It had Versus Debbie Gibson, had the Debbie pop star, Debbie Gibson. Debbie Gibson. Oh my God! And there are some scenes in there that are priceless, where she's like a, she, she's like a, a scientist, I guess. They never tell you exactly what these people do. You just you either see them like driving in submarines with a fucking joystick. I mean, 
I didn't know I didn't know submarines were that easy to to pilot with just a fucking joystick. But uh, no, man, you see her fucking uh, hanging out, being a scientist, and I swear to God, there are scenes where. They're just mixing like fucking Kool Aid together, and they're looking at these beakers like something really important's going on. You don't know what the fuck is going on, but they're just making shit change colors. And once and once they get those colors to turn into the fucking reagent from Reanimator, they're like, oh, like that, wow, that, yeah. that fluorescent green, yeah. <laughs> they're like, wow, and the, and the faces are priceless. I mean, uh, oh, the you performances know are priceless in that fucking movie. Uh, Forget no, about got, the sharks. I, the shark I, and the fucking octopus. I got to see that, man. I you do. Gotta see that. You do need to see it. Actually, it's uh, actually kind of a landmark film because it's the first time you see a uh, Chinaman uh, get together with a pop star. That's what Hyde so, told me. So yeah. you, see an Asian, you see an Asian man get together yeah. with a white woman. He, uh, an Asian then, romantic lead, fucking a Japanese guy, hooks up with Debbie Gibson, bones her. In the in the lab while they're trying to figure things out, he has enough time to bone. There's a fucking giant shark yeah. in the country, and they, <laughs> they want to. The yeah. giant shark fucking attacking fucking air fucking buses in the sky. Well, dude. I heard that the tentacle of the, well, the octopus is so big that his tentacle <laughs> can go tentacle, to the sky and take sky, out a plane. And take out a fucking jet. There's a scene. Okay, the the greatest scene is the fucking shark taking out a goddamn airbus. Unfortunately, you know it 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 came out around the same time the whole Air France plane went down. You couldn't help but think about that when <laughs> you watch that scene. I'm like, goddamn shark took down that plane. That's what <laughs> happened. Goddamn mega shark did it. Mega oh! shark. Mega shark yes. versus giant octopus. Yes. You get mad. That's balls. That fucking there. shark takes out the goddamn Golden Gate Bridge. I mean, fuck. Where else? You can't get that fucking paying ten dollars at the fucking movie theater. I'm gonna watch this, man. Oh, you have. I heard. To see I heard it. they have one that's based on Cloverfield. Oh, I where, saw that. It's called Monster. It's just tentacles. It's called you never Monster. See the monster. It's, it's, you don't ever see that motherfucker. It's just tentacles. And you know what? The funny thing is, they use the same <laughs> fucking tentacles in the fucking <laughs> octopus movie. They make. I said they don't fucking Damn. waste none of their footage, man. You know Boy, what? They are making money, man. You know what? That 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 tentacle is getting yeah. more work than Meg Ryan. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> that tentacle is going to be one famous yeah. motherfucker. Shit, that tentacle yeah. should get an award. Megan Fox, you better watch out. Yeah, so if you get old, that tentacle's going to come up. You know, yeah. TMZ well, yeah. is going to be all over that bitch. Well, yeah. Oh my god, that's a hot young thing in town. The, oh, yeah. the tentacle. Look at them goddamn slimy tentacles. We're all wet and ready to go. <laughs> Tyrese, oh that's, that's you no, need to hit on the tentacle. That was uh, it was a very retarded, entertaining film. If I do say so myself, and I do. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, all right. hey, oh, Ooh. listen to that, man. You hear that? Oh! oh Rock! 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 Rock it! Rock it! Rock it! Rock it! Rock 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 Give a checklist out. Uh, but, Everyone uh, who was there. I'm glad you named Darth Siskel first because somebody made a a, 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 a blog about the party and they forgot uh-huh. to put him in there. Oh, he's yeah, serious. I'm about that. We did a uh, podcast with him. Yeah. But, I've uh, been meaning to write a blog about the whole thing. Sure. I, I've been. I, I want to. I will. I will soon. Yeah. But it was cool that like when we were doing that podcast, they mm-hmm. all knew the words of the song. <laughs> yeah, like, they did. Like, <laughs> like the words of that. Beat. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I can barely remember the fucking band that we used to fucking to start the show. Uh, Austrian death, death uh, music, Dothian, uh, death, death tentacle, yeah. Arnold Schwarzenegger death metal, uh, the Arnold Schwarzenegger experience, <laughs> that funny band. <laughs> Jeez. Oh man, let's get some email here, man. Uh-huh. Let's do it. Uh, okay, first of all, uh, if, uh, before we get into some email, I want to let people know. Mm-hmm. Uh, we uh, we're trying to get you a badge to go to Comic Con. Thank you, but, sir. But I we will that. we will be in com- See at, at Comic Con. Uh, the majority of us will be at Comic Con. Uh, the majority of the crew. So you've always seen me at some place, and then you've seen mm-hmm. me and Cole somewhere. Now we're again trying to get the majority of people to go uh, to a certain occasion. Yeah. So we're we're going to be at Comic Con, and we don't know. Uh, we might have a table. We might have worked the table. Oh, really? I don't know. But if not, well, I'm, I'm already trying to talk to some guys so that we can. Uh, and send me an email again. That guy knows who he is. Send me an email again. Let me know who you are. Let's try to yeah. coordinate a, a Comic Con event. I can uh, only promise if I'm there, I'm there to work. I want to get as many fucking panels recorded as I can. That's to throw the, up on our site. and that's another reason I want you there because yeah. I told I already told Leon and Cyrus. I said, look, y'all ain't here to. I mean, we hit a party, but <laughs> after the work is yeah. done, you ain't I'll, got no time to look for goddamn Green Lantern number forty two and all that kind of <laughs> shit. Yeah, 